<laughs> Tremendously, like I ain't, I ain't, I ain't. words really can't explain don't, don't just how much I, I've developed, don't like you mentally and some, physically. Some, you know what I mean? Um, some, Coach Hart just Boston making Boston tremendous like adjustments as far as my just I mean, route been, running and things we'll like that. Like I came in more so as a with running back experience. Um, pretty much just building on my own as a receiver, but. Just doing all the right yeah, things, it's been like it's been a huge, and, I mean, a huge it, slowdown and, and, for me, especially, just and then just just a huge change, honestly. Nobody gets a chance to say hi to him after Julius. That's where he's going. I know they'll be back in their starters. Thank you, thank you, Emilio. Pay off, but yeah, I do want to see the opportunity here to maybe establish yourself. What do we have here? Oh yeah, absolutely, definitely. Um, that's been a goal for me, really, just just becoming. Reliable, making a uh, routine plays, routine, just like Coach Day always say. And, um, yeah, that's just to answer the question, absolutely. Caleb, what do you feel like are the things that you can bring to this offense that maybe differentiates you from other players here? Um, just my ability to just um, run after the catch, honestly. Uh, that would probably be the number one thing, just uh, what I could do after the catch. Um, what else? Uh, Folks, just making, I would say just the making 20. the plays, just making a, the big time plays, you know what I mean? As a big time player when it counts for real. What was just the first year here at Ohio State like for you, kind of that development process like? It was crazy. Um, like I said, uh, I, I came a long way as far as development mentally and uh, physically just as a receiver. Cause like I said, I played running back. And um, just making that transition over just my footwork and everything like that is just a whole, a huge shift. And just absolutely, like, really coming off of, like, our winter workouts has been a huge shift as far as, like, my speed and things like that. I feel way faster. And it's just, even with my, um, what was it, back in the summer when I came down, I had a knee injury. So it's like I didn't really get to, um, get to, like, condition and do all the things with the team. So I was really pretty much on a bike and just working out and things like that. But now that I got spring and everything in the books, it's just everything slowed down for me and I, I feel a lot faster. Do you see yourself as someone who could do kind of like what Xavier was doing last year where you could play some receiver, play some running back? Absolutely. I mean, uh, wherever, wherever I'm needed, I'm definitely able to step up. So, absolutely. I know you've been doing some punt returns too. How much do you think you could be an asset in that way? That's, that's probably one of my first goals right now, just getting on um, punt return. And making making an um, impact there first, definitely. Do you kind of see that as an opportunity? If hey, if there's if there's all this talent at receiver, punt return might be my opportunity to play my first big role here. Absolutely, definitely, yes, sir. Caleb, what's it like when you get here and you expect to learn on the field from Jackson for a year, and you know that, that he's mm -hmm. a guy that everybody wants to be like, and you don't have him on the field to learn from all year? What's what's that? What was that like for you guys? What was it like? Mm. I got a taste of it, honestly. Uh, just fall camp, really just, I grasped so many things from him, from that, just those, you know what I'm saying, the weeks that he was there. And um, definitely everybody wanted to see him play, obviously. But like I said, I took what I could from him, and um, that was really all I could do, really. I don't think anybody's going to compare you to Marv, the differences in size right now. But, but to be able to learn from Marv, mm -hmm. watch him work. How easy is it to, to latch onto that and be able to work the way he does? Oh, easy, 100%. Like, he's definitely a leader. I mean, just his mentality, I, that's probably the best thing about him, just his mentality. And to, the fact that he just falls in love with development. And um, that's just one thing just to look up to in itself, just uh, the way he's always here, like pretty much never leaves from here. And um, just always putting in work. So it's just a mentality thing that I definitely look up to him for. You don't work hard. That might work. You would be if you didn't work hard. Uh -huh. But when you see a guy like that, he literally never leaves here. Does it maybe change your viewpoint, your mindset of how you need to approach this and how you can actually get on the field here? Uh -huh. Um. It changes it in a way. Probably reminds you of like certain things. Just you know, what I mean, just to get back on schedule. Uh, that's probably that's probably really about it as far as the viewpoint on it. What, what, what do you see your role in this offense? I mean, obviously, the, the 
offense has gone away a little bit from like the Curtis Samuel stuff mm -hmm. and you know what always used to be called the Percy Harvin position around here. But that's sort of your specialty, right? You you were a running back in high school. You can do things in a lot of different ways. Where do you see yourself fitting in this offense? Um. Definitely a four down player. Um, somebody that's reliable, you know what I mean? Somebody that can be counted on. And um, similar to Jackson, honestly. That's probably the the, easy, the best comparison I could put it to, really. Getting a chance to return punts, maybe. You know, do you know how long it's been since anyone in Ohio State returned punt for touchdown? Uh, oh. Ah, Coach Fleming was actually telling me about this, but I'm not sure. 2014. So 2014. When you get back there, what is your mindset? Is it attack? Is it just catch it? Or, I mean, how do you how do you see yourself in, in that role? Uh, definitely get a jump on the ball, and I'm taking like any opportunity I could get. You know what I mean for extra right yards. Folks, we have Reese Stocksdale on the 30. If I can, yes sir. Yes. For sure. For sure. Thanks for sure. No problem. Yep. Caleb, thank you.